السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ Did you like it? Yeah. yeah. Welcome. Yeah. That's good. Exact. You are 12.30 at the door. That, sh- that actually gestured for me that you like the previous class, inshallah. Today, uh, we were talking in the girls class about the parents, mm-hmm. how important they are. We are just listening that um, we should be take care of the parents, but we didn't know how to and why, because now we want to learn everything by the reasons. First of all, this is order of Allah Kareem and this is the way, the sunnah, the method of our Prophet Hazrat Muhammad Alayhi wa sallam and Nabi Kareem sallallahu alayhi wa sallam there is a hadith that if you look at the face of your parents with, with love with love you get reward of accepted hajj and one of the companion of the prophet hazrat muhammad sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wasallam he said if i am looking at my parents every day 70 time and our prophet sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wasallam respond yes you get reward of 70 hajj how easy it is we are just looking at our parents with love again again and getting the hajj with the love with the care and there is another hadith that uh, paradise is lies under the feet of mothers mm-hmm. if you take care of your mothers and uh, you you go to the paradise and uh, another mention uh, in the narration that uh, paradise have a two strong doors which is opened by the parents actually they are doors of the paradise both mother and the father if we take care of them that door we own that door they will open on the day of judgment for us inshallah and how we can take care of our parents some people said you guys are lucky alhamdulillah rabbil alamin allah kareem give a long life to your parents with the health wealth prosperity inshallah but some kids don't have a parents they say what we can do we don't have a parents then their aunties their uncles their pupos khalas their grandpa their grandma nani nana dadi dada they all parents and over here if you don't have extended family even some kids are saying that then the friends of your parents they are equal equivalent to your parents once son of hazrat umar farooq hazrat abdullah bin umar he was traveling to the other city he has one donkey or the horse because olden time the ancient time there is a transportation by the camels and by the horses and donkeys mm-hmm. and he he has only one uh, one source on the of the traveling donkey or the horse he was sitting on that and he has very less stuff with him if because it was very hot he want to cover his head with the shawl or the sheet 
and he was going and he, he saw an old person he said oh you are son of umar farooq he said yes he said i'm your father's friend and he remembered that when he was a kid and they are the friends he gave his only uh, horse to him his shawl to him and his slave said now how you will travel because whatever you have you gave it to him and you, you have a long journey he said no he is my father's friend equivalent to my father that's why i want to give him the same respect allah kareem make another source for me so if you don't have your parents in the life that's the best the kids they don't have they take care of their because and you as well you nani nana dadi dada khala phuphi they all parents and their friends you have to give respect to them as well now how in these days you guys can help to your parents did you have any idea how you want to help them out supposing for the daddy first how you want to help your dad uh, financially financially mashallah financially what you want to do for them financially like you know assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh financially what you want to do for them mean you want to yeah. do the job you want to do the job and then you help them out yeah, yeah good because yeah. over high school you guys have a job usually mm-hmm. and uh, usually i saw the kids they have a job but they spend whole money on their phones uh, mm-hmm. they change them uh, their cell phone and the laptop and all the devices they pay attention to devices more than the parents mm-hmm. you can help them financially and what about if they are cleaning the car in the summer usually what do you want to do for them you can go help them help your parents in cleaning the cars what about the groceries do you want to pick the groceries it's very hard you never realize the grocery from the car to inside the house mm-hmm. it's a hard to pick all the bags and bring it in so daddy is the one who is bringing yes i can have four bags at once really that's very good so help them to picking the uh, groceries even you, i'm not saying you to uh, every time you are available to go with them for the grocery mm-hmm. shopping and it's costly for the parents too because you have a demands over there you want to buy this 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 mm-hmm. so better be to take out the grocery from the trunk okay <laughs> so grocery you can help them in the grocery from the trunk what else you want to do for them they are tired he came from office and if any physical massage did you ever did your daddy his shoulders massage yes, his feet sir. massage you did i did mashallah intiya you did yeah mashallah barakallah what umar not really intiya just does it intiya does always do that and i give you the tip when you massaging your daddy's feet and the shoulder you have to look with love at his face you get accepted haj this much reward because our prophet hazrat muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam sallallahu alaihi wasallam hazrat muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam mashallah mashallah la quwata illa billah he he narrated in hadith when you look at your father with love with love allah kareem grant you the ajr the sawab the reward of the one hajj and even 70 time when you are massaging look at the daddy with love and what about mommy what kind of help of your mom you can do that yes look mommy is not on boys list ever no, he, yes he, he is doing he is doing my foot massage sometimes and i'm okay so fun what do you want to do for your mommy to help her out please what do you do i want to listen from safwan actually he does every time he he doesn't remember oh yeah mashallah he helps me a lot he is the only one always available for me oh mashallah la quwata illa billah yes massage to the mommy's feet too massage yes what else what about the dishes are we you, you throw the dishes in the sink You eat and throw the dishes in the sink. I know that all boys. <laughs> I have three boys at home. Yes. Some boys even don't put the dishes in the in sink. In the sink on yes. on the That's table. Right. <laughs> you don't know. Surprises. <laughs> yeah. Where you leave the dishes when you eat food? I put in the sink. Sorry. Put in the sink. Sink. 
That's okay. the and there's a main thing when you put in the sink, always put ups and down because shaitan licks your leftover. Never leave. I came here, I saw this plate sitting, so I covered it. Because when the food is in the plate, shaitan licks that and the plate curse to the person who eat that and leave the plate open naked for the licking of shaitan. When you leave in the sink, put the towel, paper towel are ups and down and the two plates subsident together to cover that. Don't leave the plates for the shaitan. Okay, this is sunnah too. Yes, massage and what dishes? If I asked you to wash everybody their own dish, is it possible? Can I request to you? Imtiaz, mommy don't want to allow you to come to the kitchen? No? What she said? What she said? They make mess, I know, because I have the boys. Yes, they make mess. She said better than I want to do that. Yeah. Because everywhere is the soap and everything, the water, mm -hmm. chapa chap. Mm -hmm. Try to learn. Because yeah. definite after five years, for your wife, you have to clean it. Mm -hmm. They don't care. They will teach you in one week how to clean the dishes. Mommy can teach you in the 25 years and you don't want to learn. But the wives will teach you so quickly and the second day of the wedding, you will washing the dishes on the sink. And you do it so nicely, so clean. <laughs> yes, I know that. So better be to learn right now. Okay? And from today, you guys are doing the dishes.